हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम मधुरा वेलकम टू मधुराज रेसिपी डॉट कॉम टुडे आई एम मेकिंग पंजाबी कड़ी पकोड़ा आई ऑफन मेक कड़ी पकोड़ा एट होम एंड आई जस्ट कुडेंट रेजिस्ट टू शेयर दिस रेसिपी विथ यू नाउ दिस पंजाबी कड़ी पकोड़ा इज स्लाइटली डिफरेंट दैन अदर वेरिएशन ऑफ रिजनल कड़ीज पंजाबी कड़ी पकोड़ा इज क्वाइट थिकर एंड क्रीमियर and this onion pakoda makes an added attraction that makes this thoroughly irresistible so to start we'll uh, first make the batter for making this uh, pakode so here i'm taking half a cup of besan or chickpea flour gram flour into a bowl season that up with powdered masala turmeric powder quarter teaspoon of red chili powder क्वार्टर टी स्पून ऑफ गरम मसाला पिंच ऑफ अजवायन सॉल्ट टू टेस्ट जस्ट अ पिंच ऑफ बेकिंग सोडा मिक्स दिस एवरीथिंग आफ्टर पाउडर्ड मसाला आर वेल कंबाइंड विद दिस चिकपी फ्लॉ Add in a cup of thinly sliced onion in this chickpea flour. Some finely chopped coriander leaves and mix it. Let's add in water. Just one or two tablespoon of water is more than enough to make this it into a batter this onion pakoda batter is already now even though this mixture looks little bit thick right now this onions are going to lose moisture and it will become more loose after some time so keep this covered for half an hour now let's make kadhi mixture ready so in a bowl over here i am adding half cup of thick yogurt mix this really good make it nice and creamy now in that add in 3 tablespoon of besan or chickpea flour salt half teaspoon of garam masala half teaspoon of turmeric powder and red chili powder mix this really good and now i'm adding 1 and 1/2 cups of water stir this and now this curry mixture is all ready now let's start to make curry and for that here i have preheated a tablespoon of mustard oil into a kadai make sure to use large bottomed pan so that while boiling the kadai it does not spill i have added half teaspoon of cumin seeds let them season 8 to 10 fenugreek seeds methi ke seeds then goes in finely chopped onion followed by some green chili and grated ginger and saute onions for 3 to 4 minutes after onion turns soft add in 8 to 10 curry leaves followed by dried red chili give that a mix now load on the heat and pour in this curry mixture into this tempering just stir this one more time and pour in slowly now increase the flame to medium and bring this curry to a boil keep on stirring so that bottom doesn't get browned and 
and once this curry comes to a boil reduce the heat to low to medium and allow it to simmer for 10 minutes and while our curry is simmering let's just go ahead and fry this onion pakoras and you can see the batter has turned nice and thin after resting it for a while now with the help of fork I'm going to drop these pakoras in the hot oil After about 3 minutes, turn them around and continue to fry for 3 to 4 more minutes. Once the pakoras get nice deep golden color, remove them, shake off all the excess oil and transfer them onto a kitchen towel. Over here this curry is simmered over low to medium heat for 10 minutes now and you can see that this curry has started to become thick. Now this curry turns too thick then uh, you can add some hot water to adjust the consistency. Now drop in this onion pakoras. Superb. cover let them get soaked in the curry now cover this up and allow it to simmer for 8 to 10 more minutes and this onion pakoras are simmered in curry for 10 minutes now let's take that out and see the consistency it has turned nice thick and creamy perfect now serve this hot piping hot steamy curry with some steamed rice or jeera rice with a dollop of ghee over it. So if you are watching my video for the first time and if you haven't subscribed then please remember to subscribe so that uh, you will be the first to get informed about my latest recipe or my latest video. Also please remember to hit the like button. Thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye bye.